guys. How's it going? What's hey, happening? Ethan, how are you, man? Good. How you doing? Good. 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 Awesome. Thanks for chatting with us today. Yes, sir. Thanks I'm, I'm checking out all, all the you, toys behind yeah, you. Yeah, are there. you going to add a Mario and Luigi to that? Or what? <laughs> they're downstairs. They're they're on top of my Nintendo. So yeah. Oh, yeah, there you go. Good. Don't worry. I'm represented. <laughs> so Chris, obviously, one of the big questions about this is the Mario voice and deciding what sure. kind of voice you want to do for him. So was there ever discussion about doing a more of an Italian voice, or how did you settle on the voice we hear in the movie? Well, there were certainly discussions of how to best voice the character. Um, you know, yeah, we 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 discussed. We discussed everything and tried a lot of different things and ultimately settled on the voice that you hear when you watch the movie. And uh, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, um, I'm really happy with it. And I think, I think people are going to, once they see the movie, be really caught up in it and, and really enjoy it. The real question is, who did you channel for the Brooklyn grit that you added to it? Did you have a particular person you looked to for that? Well, I had I had a few things I was aiming at, but I feel like if I say them out loud, it could potentially affect people's ability to watch the the performance oh, so i won't smart. say it yeah i won't say it but i had it i had like a, a there's a couple post. like movies i'm sure and like you know character actors that you your mind goes to when you think great brooklyn accent right. yeah you know that i think i would slip into some sometimes where they were like hey a little less of this you know maybe iconic uh italian actor yeah, <laughs> you know, I, like, yeah exactly i give us a little more charlie but uh you know Right. Yeah. I guess, Charlie, to that question, I mean, were you conscious about sounding too Italian? Like, uh, like, how did you sort of want to walk that line as, as, as Mario? Yeah, as well, I mean, you know, um, being born in New York City and then having lived in New York City for many, many years and then being uh, uh, having Italian heritage uh, and then then living in Rhode Island and then living near Providence for, you know, knowing so many of those different accents, you know, some are thicker than others. So sometimes... I would try versions of them that that uh, maybe sounded a little more Providence than um, Brooklyn, but uh, uh, they would sort of always steer me towards what they wanted, you know. And um, I I certainly enjoyed getting to do them all, and uh, um, would have been happy with whatever direction they wanted to go. <laughs> yeah, <it's laughs> I, mean, I guess the main question is just making sure you don't sound too stereotypical. I guess that's always the worry. It's like, yeah, well, yeah, yeah. It, really, it's kind of their medium, you know, like the, by they, I mean, uh, Aaron and, and Michael who are directing it. We It takes two years and dozens of sessions and you just throw a bunch of different stuff at the wall and then they come back and they go, hey, you know, listen to this. This is a compilation of stuff that you did that we think is close to where we want it to be. Let's let's work in this area. So you do that and then you find that they start refining that list, at least for me, that reference, audio reference pass at the beginning of every session. They were adding stuff to it, taking stuff away. So even they were really kind of uh, determining exactly how the voice would sound right up to the end uh, of, of cutting the movie together. Yeah. Cool. Chris, I know your son Jack is is a big Marvel fan, but he doesn't. He's Star Lord isn't one of his favorite characters. We know you've said so. Is Mario his favorite Nintendo character? Or does he have another? Well, actually, no. He likes. He plays Smash, and when he plays Smash Brothers, uh, he's always Luigi. So Man, um, he is working you. He's hard. working me he out. Knows yeah. he, he knows how to get your number. Doesn't yeah, he? he's yeah. He he likes to rib he's his old a man. Smart kid. Yeah, he is. Like, Charlie, you flattered to know that 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 uh, the Jack. I'm highly was... flattered. Good choice, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> How about your son? Who, who's your son's favorite Nintendo character, uh, Charlie? Uh, you know, he likes both Mario and Luigi. He's uh, agnostic when it comes to which character to to pull for. But um, uh, he, you know, he, he seems to like all video games, but uh, especially Nintendo video games. So he's pretty jazzed up for this film. <laughs> Well, just to make Chris feel better, we should say it's Mario that you're so. Let's favorite. say it's no, Mario. We'll, we'll oh, it is. Okay. Yeah, it's Mario. Oh, yeah. that's nice. At least one of our sons likes me. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, Thanks, no. guys. Actually, Thanks, Jack care. also really loves Toad. He's a big oh. fan of Toad. Yeah. Yeah. He's like he has like a a Toad hat. He's like, oh, Dad, I should have wore my Toad hat today. Like he's got a Toad uh, stuffy. He's got like two oh, different Toad stuffies go. and a hat. And so he's he's a big fan of Toad. And he likes to point out that Toad has teeth in the movie. <laughs> no, Toad didn't have teeth before, Dad. I Dad. didn't catch that. Toad has teeth. That's the first time Toad's ever had teeth. <laughs> I love it. We're making canon. Yeah, this is now canon. Toad has teeth. I love it. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Thanks, guys. Appreciate the time. Thank you. See you.